Hello everyone, this video I'm going to speak about pronesse and lauri acids and bases. Let's get started. First thing, we have to know what is the focus of this theory. Pronesse and lauri definitions for acids and bases is based on proton transfer. What is the proton that we are speaking about? It is the H positive. So it's very important to be vigilant to the H positive transfer. An acid, according to Professor Lowry, is a substance that can donate proton, which is H positive, while a base is a substance that can accept this proton, which is H positive. Let's check an equation here. We have here H3O positive plus PO4 3 negative, uh, and it's giving HPO4 2 negative plus H2O. First of all, we have to check what has what is happening here. What has happened to H3O positive? What has happened to it? Okay, it already lost H, so it should be acid. Why? Because as we said, hydrogen, when hydrogen is donated, so this is an acid. So H3O positive is acid because it has donated H positive. How I may know it's acid? By checking the reactants and the products. What has happened to H3O positive? It lost H positive, so it is uh, acid. Uh, when the acid is losing H positive, it will become a conjugate base. So H2O here is a conjugate base. What about PO43 negative? PO43 negative here, as you again, we will check what has happened to this uh, uh, specific reactant. It gained H positive. For that reason, it is a base. And the product of uh, the base, after losing H positive, it is a conjugate acid. So it's very, very important to highlight this point. When a pronested Lowry acid loses a proton, it forms a base. This base, known as conjugate base. And the two together are known as acid conjugate base pair. Let's check another example here. We have an H3, H2O, produce an H4 positive plus OH negative. We would like to highlight what is the acid, what is the uh, base, and their uh, conjugate base or conjugate acids. First of all, let's check NH3. What has happened to NH3? I cannot just say that NH3 is acid or base from just looking at the reactant. We have to check what has happened to NH3. Okay, it gained H positive. For that reason, it is a base. And the product of NH3 being uh, gaining H positive will make it a conjugate, NH4 positive, conjugate acid. Okay, the other reactant, which is H2O. What has happened to H2O? Uh, it lost H positive, so it is acid. Okay, and the product is a conjugate base. So it's very important to highlight another point here, which is the conjugate acid base pair differ by a single proton. Single proton. The difference between NH3 and the NH4 positive, single proton. The difference between H2O, OH negative, a single proton.